Hi, guys, this video is going to show you how to recover permanently deleted photos on iPhone. Alright, we all should know that when we delete a photo in the Photos app, it will move to the recently deleted folder and stay there for up to 30 days before being permanently deleted. We could easily restore the deleted photo back to camera roll by tapping the recover at the bottom left of the screen. What if you manually delete the photos from recently deleted album? This is the permanently deleted photos recovery that this article will talk about. We're here telling you three free ways to get back permanently deleted photos on iPhone. You can recover your lost or deleted photos with or without a backup. Method 1, Download Permanently Deleted Photos from iCloud If you've turned on iCloud Photos to sync all photos to iCloud, and before the permanent deletion of photos on your iPhone, you turned off iCloud Photos, you can download the photos from iCloud to restore the deleted items. Go to Settings on your iPhone, tap, Your Name, at the top, tap iCloud, then tap Photos, and turn on the toggle for Sync This iPhone. After iCloud Photos is turning on, you can choose Download and Keep Originals to get the full resolution photos back to your iPhone, or select Optimize iPhone Storage option to download the smaller, device sized versions if your device is low on space. Now come back to Photos app, and you should see the downloading process, restoring photos to your library. If you didn't use iCloud Photos or you don't have any backup for your photos in iTunes or iCloud, you could try AppGeeker iOS data recovery software to recover permanently deleted photos from iPhone itself. We've put the download link in the description below. Method 2, Retrieve Permanently Deleted Photos from iTunes Backup Ok, if you have an iTunes backup that is made before your photos become permanently deleted or lost, you have two ways of recovering the photos to your iPhone. One is to restore the iPhone backup through iTunes, which will replace any current device content that is not included in the backup. And the other one is to use AppGeeker iOS data recovery tool I just mentioned to view and retrieve iPhone photos deleted permanently from iTunes backup without restoring entire iPhone. To restore your deleted photos and other data from iTunes backup, connect your iPhone to your computer via USB cable, and open iTunes. Then at the top left corner, click on the tiny device icon. Choose Summary from the left column. Click Restore Backup button. When a dialog box opens, select a backup that contains the photos that you deleted permanently, and hit Restore button to begin restoring iTunes backup to get photos back to Photos app. This may take some time to finish depending on how much data storing in the iTunes backup. Method 3, Restore Permanently Deleted Photos from iCloud Backup Restoring iCloud Backup is also a feasible way to recover permanently deleted photos from iPhone. The only thing is to make sure the iCloud Backup you tend to restore photos from must include those pictures that have been deleted or disappeared. You can only check when the iCloud Backup was successfully created in Settings. Your name. iCloud. iCloud Backup, but you can't access the backup to view the data. Before you can actually perform iPhone photo recovery via iCloud Backup, you need to first erase all content and settings on the phone. Alright, go to Settings, tap General. Tap Transfer or Reset iPhone, choose Erase all content and settings to reset your iPhone. We just wait until the reset process finishes. OK, now, Hello screen appears. Set up the iPhone until you get to Apps and Data screen. Here from the list, choose Restore from iCloud Backup. Then sign into iCloud account with your Apple ID and password. Select the most recent iCloud Backup to restore your iPhone and bring all permanently deleted photos back. The recovered photos will return to iPhone Photos Library. That's all for this video. Hope you guys find and recover permanently deleted photos on iPhone successfully. It's also important to back up any phone data to avoid unexpected loss. Please like and subscribe our channel to get more useful iPhone tips. Feel free to leave your questions in the comments section below. 
Thanks for watching. See you next video.